Matt, first and foremost, mission accomplished. You beat the Browns, and you're 12 and three. Yeah, well, it certainly wasn't easy, and we'll never apologize for winning. And you got to give Cleveland a lot of credit. They battled. They battled for four quarters. But the real difference in this game was the turnover battle. And when you're plus four, you should you should win the game. One of the headlines, of course, Aaron Rodgers breaking Brett Favre's record. Can you kind of put that in perspective as his coach? Wow, it's what a special moment. That was great. Just the tribute, obviously, and he is one of a kind. A special person, special quarterback. I love coming to work with him every day. Four interceptions, as you mentioned, three setting up TDs and one icing the game. You couldn't ask for more timely defense. Yeah, I know it wasn't our best in terms of their ability to move the football. Certainly missed a lot of tackles. They had a lot of success in the ground game on third down, which has been an area that we have to get better at. But you mentioned it. I mean, those were timely picks, and we were able to capitalize on those turnovers. Those four turnovers, you add to those five sacks. Does that kind of offset the Cleveland Browns' ability to run the football? Yes and no. Uh, certainly, you can't allow a team to go out there and, and do that to you. I know one of the big runs they had was on a third down and long. I think it was third and nine or third and ten for 40 some odd yards that set up a touchdown. So, um, yeah, we're happy about all the, the big splash plays that we made defensively with the sacks and the turnovers, but consistency down in and down out, we, we've got to do better. Big night for Devontae Adams, 10 catches, 114 yards, two touchdowns, and he and Aaron Rodgers become the most productive TD duo in franchise history. There was times in the first half where the Browns just couldn't cover Devontae or defend Aaron Rodgers' throws. Yeah, and, and I think probably just looking back at it, we probably should have been giving them more opportunities in the second half as well. But, you know, just we're fortunate. We'll, we'll learn from everything that went on out there and, and we'll get better from it. Matt, I know you don't like this kind of stuff, but I'm going to take a gamble and do it anyway. Tonight you tied the league record for most wins in the first three years of a head coach's tenure, 38. That's a lot of wins. Yeah, it's a credit to everybody in that locker room, our players, our coaches, you know, our personnel staff, everybody associated with this organization just doing their 111th. These seasons are long, they're grueling. It takes a lot of effort, a lot of focus and concentration on what's right in front of you, and it's a credit to just everybody coming with that that same mentality of trying to go one and all each week. Matt, you guys made it a Merry Christmas for Packer fans everywhere. Yeah, Merry Christmas to everybody out there.